I'm at this job here. We're gonna shut down the towers. This is the same job Steven reared and met me on. Shut these guys off. Uh, say what? I'm gonna drain everything. Yo, go all the way to the corner and shut off the makeup. Yeah, all the way in the corner is a little pipe. So we're gonna drain these. So it's winter time, the heat pumps. Uh, they'll just go to her, uh, the heat exchanger down, the heat exchanger plate downstairs. And uh, we have another heat exchanger that's uh, together with the boiler. That will warm up the, that will warm up the water. I'll show you guys everything. I'm not good at explaining shit. We got the pumps off, we're gonna drain this entire system. And then, uh, yeah, oh, BACs. Hey, Martin. Look, look, right there, that corner. See the valve? Right over there. This makeup line. You see, follow this pipe right here. You see this uh, little one inch pipe? Follow that. I'm gonna start with the draining here. And it's raining outside. Yeah, close it. Good man. Look at all these, these old bad boys here. Your head on these suckers. They're 40 horsepower. So we're gonna just drain everything. This tower doesn't work in the winter time. It's just uh summertime. Winter time it's a closed loop. It just stays on. Goes through the heat exchanger plate. Uh, and if the water gets cold uh, from the heat pumps, uh, we have another heat exchanger that will warm up the water. There's a pump that comes on, maintains the 885 degree uh, water temperature, and uh, just goes to a bypass and uh, warms the system loop. All right, I'm gonna open up this guy right here. There goes my baby. There's a fire department. Woo! But there, look at this shit, kid. I love it. A lot of water in this sucker. We drain and we have more water. Ugh. Huh? I know. I hope that the guys who did the roof, <laughs> I hope there's no leaks in the roof. The guys just did the, they just did this roof not too long ago because it was leaking. <laughs> I hope they did a good job. I want to point out all these valves are Chinese made. Everything is Chinese. I hate that shit because they don't last. These, they start rusting. The brass start, it starts rusting. I guess it's, it's just crazy. The cooling tower is isolated. This is the cooling tower pipes. Uh, the closed loop still remains and we'll go through this heat exchanger show you guys show a lot of you guys know what this is uh, so when the pumps uh, the heat pumps are running in heat mode obviously the water is going to get colder so we need something that will keep it warm and that heat exchanger is down on the fourth floor we'll go up there and show you guys all right let the sucker drain is it draining I'm just draining the remainder of the tower. That's draining the, these two lines. It's the tower, cool tower. So if you guys, this is the condenser water return. 
supply. And we got this line right here. You can see the supply basically comes through here. Okay. Goes through the heat exchanger. That water will the heat exchanger go into the return. And this is the pump that will circulate that. So as soon as the temperature reaches the desired number, which is 8085, the pump will shut off and system loop will be 8085 so they can run the heat pumps. Hot water heat exchanger. <laughs> 